If I've learned anything in my 25 years of bowling, it's that strikes don't win tournaments, spares do. In this next lesson, I'll approach spare making in two different ways. The first way is hard and straight with a plastic ball. The key to shooting your spares hard and straight with a plastic ball is to make sure that when you come through in your release, your hand is straight and behind the ball and you follow through in a straight line, nice and long, at your target. When shooting left hand spares, I like to split the lane in half. So I'm going to put my left foot on board 20, cut the lane in half, and whatever pin I'm shooting at, I draw an imaginary line from that pin to me, wherever it crosses at the arrows, that's where I aim at in a straight line with a straight release and a long follow through. So say that I'm shooting the seven pin. I draw that imaginary line from the seven pin to me. It crosses right through board 20. I'm going to aim at the middle arrow in a straight line right at the seven pin. The same goes for your right hand spares, except I use the entire lane. So instead of cutting the lane in half, I'm going to move my left foot all the way to the edge of the lane, draw that imaginary line from the 10 pin to me, or whatever pin that you're shooting. It crosses, again, board 20. I'm going to aim at 20 in a straight line with my hand straight behind the ball in a long follow through. It's an easy and simple way to shoot spares, hard and straight with a plastic ball. You can move around, get a feel for it. There's no rules about shooting spares with a plastic ball, hard and straight. Do what works. This is just a guide, but you can do that for any single pin spare that is left up. I wouldn't suggest using a straight release, straight ball for multiple pin combinations. But in the next segment, I'm going to talk to you about the 369 approach to shooting spares.